Hey friends, this is a custom handheld video game I made for my son and his friends. Let me show you how I did it. This is my son Jonas. His ninth birthday was coming up and he said he wanted a video game themed birthday party. So as a father and a child of the 80s, I felt like this is a moment my life had been preparing me for. Growing up, games were more than just play. They were how my friends and I formed bonds, and I wanted my son and his friends to experience that same joy. I've dabbled with Ardu Boy before, an Arduino-based gaming system, and it sparked an idea. Why not build custom handheld games for each of his friends to take home? Much like the Tiger Electronic games from my childhood. After some number crunching, I found I could make it work within budget. But I didn't want just any game, I wanted something personal. Having grown up with shows like Clarissa Explains It All, where she magically makes video games featuring the people in her life, I was inspired to put him in the game. But not just him, what if each of his friends at the party were playable characters in the game? My son loved the idea, so now it wasn't just an option, it was a mission. But with a tight timeline, I had to keep the gameplay simple. An infinite runner, just running and jumping. But still, time was running short. So I reached out to my buddy Chase, a game developer and pixel artist. Hey, I'm Chase. He helped me with the art, and together we programmed the game. We added obstacles and unique abilities for each character, and I created a level editor to have better control over the design of the ground segments. I used Eagle CAD software to design the circuit boards and then soldered on all the parts. I used Blender to design the case and then 3D printed it. It was a bit of trial and error, but the end result was worth it. The game is just running and jumping, avoiding pits and enemies with varying degrees of difficulty that gets faster and increase as you collect more coins and increase your high score. Of course, the custom games were just part of the fun. We also set up a maze design station where kids could create mazes that we scanned using a webcam and OpenCV technology. And with Makey Makey, hardware that allows you to make custom controllers out of anything, they controlled the game by giving each other high fives. You play by navigating the maze from start to finish and trying to guess which of your friend's mazes it is to complete it. In the main event, a Mario Kart tournament with 3D printed trophies. Seeing the joy on their faces, knowing that we'd created something unique and memorable, that was the real prize. Not just a game, but a memory. 